Welcome back to Let's Play Kirby's Dream Collection, episode 41. This is the ending of Kirby 64. Aw, Dark Matter's destroyed. Look at that. Yeah, there it goes. We did it all, and everything's all great, but the crystal shard... Oh! Oh! Wait. Oh, it purified her. Good. This is because we got all the crystal shards. Oh, it's creating a huge dark matter. Hold on, let me make a call. Hang on. I gotta call my friends from Amazing Mirror. What's up, boys? You bring the pizza? So we'll hop on the big gigantic warp star, sailing over to this new world that came out of the Queen. Jeez. <laughs> oh, big bad level right here at the end. This is Dark Star. Ooh. It's just Kinda an obstacle of, course, right? Reminds me of the finale to uh, Super Mario RPG. Yeah, I can see that. Alright, so, well, anything over there? Well, then we go here. What do you got for us, Hedeline? Maximum are, Tomato? Oh, uh, nice. you rock, girl. Yeah. So, are there crystal shards in here? Um, this is it. Now it's time for the real final boss. Aha! I knew it! The hell? This is zero two. Oh. Zero squared, O2, whatever you want to call it. Oh. He's a bit of a dick. Yeah, he's kicking your ass, dude. And you're running out of crystal shards to shoot. <laughs> yeah, you never you never run out of crystal shards, thankfully. Oh, thank God, yeah. So, shoot him in the big eyeball, right? Shoot him in his big dumb eye. Then you shoot him in his big dumb band-aid halo. Oh! Isn't that where you heard him last time you fought this guy? I think you fought this guy. Yep, and then his big gigantic spiky green penis comes out, and you gotta shoot that. Oh. And that's, and that's how you damage him. Oh. That's, that's so many phases. Well, at least you're getting a good fence on him. Look at that. Look how much damage you're doing. Yeah, doing good. Now we're back here. Oh, darn it. Wait, I, I need to listen to this theme a bit more. This sounds great. Yeah, let me crank it for you. Although I really don't like this final boss because... You gotta constantly keep moving, mm -hmm. and, a, and a reticle would have really, really helped. Yeah, I think so, but one stick. Maybe they could have used the C buttons, maybe. Just just something to let me know where I'm aiming at, where the crystals are gonna approximately land. Right, right. Wait, did that wear off? Yeah. So you uh, have to, like, immediately shoot the top of his head that you can barely see because he's not moving forward? Yeah, I've never had as many problems as with this final battle as I have with this time, revisiting it 17 years later or whatever. Oof. Well, oh, by the way, what's that copy combination there? That's crystal shard and what? A crane of some sort? I don't know. Some sort of claw, sword. Well, that's know. pretty awesome. Maybe, maybe it's a ribbon. I have no idea. Because she's got, like, the <laughs> ribbon, so, like, ri ribbon plus crystal shard equals now we can save the universe. Okay, yeah, the the game-winning weapon. That'll work. Kirby Superstar didn't have this, no way. <laughs> Therefore, bad game. <laughs> Come on. Uh. Get hit in the eyeball a couple more million times. Just, just a little white dot. All I would have asked for would have helped matters greatly. Oh, you mean the one right in the middle of his cornea? It's just something to let me know where the fuck I'm aiming, because... Oh, go, it's... go, 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 go! Right, oh. right now it's like trying to put eye drops in me. Yes! Kill the tail thing! I told you what it is, it's not a tail. If Kill it were the... a tail, if it were a tail, it'd be on his back! 
But it's not on his back, yeah. is it? No, it's right on his underbelly. So that's what it is. It's a gigantic spiky green cactus penis. Destroy the cactus cactus. Do it. The cactus. The cactus. Yes. <laughs> yes, the cactus. No, this ain't gonna get uh, approved for all of the advertisers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, definitely not now! Oh, Damn no. it! Uh, the universe is destroyed! Oh, I gotta do that again now. <laughs> Alright. Uh, what's on my wall here? Let's see. Um, uh, uh, alright. I got five PS4 games here. Uh, tell me what, uh, you, uh, just tell me what you're playing. Okay. Uh, uh just, just pick five games that you're playing right now and we'll trade off. All right. this, is supposed to, this is gonna be non-sequitur hour while I get back to where I was, especially when it's so hard to hit this motherfucker. Sure, yeah, sure. We got time. Yeah, oh, we got time. Uh, I've been playing Cuphead. Great game. Uh, yeah, good. Uh, I've been playing Uta Wadadu Mono, Mask of Truth. Oh, yeah. The third you game in the series, yeah. Yeah, you showed me that game. That's tactical RPG, right? Yeah, it's it's more tactical RPG the, this time around now. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty good, pretty good. Might play some more tonight. Excellent. All right, oh. what do you got? Well, uh, on my desk upstairs, I've got uh, Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga plus Bowser's Minions. Oh, yeah, how is that? I never realized how much I missed Superstar Saga, but it is a fantastic <laughs> game. And all those, I'm like... Like yeah, my all those partners in time. As a result, you know? yeah, and all those special animations—they are—they've been remade with 3D models, and they work. I like it. Mm. Cool. Hey, Rosie, I gotta finish Paper Jam. Do you though? Anyway, well, I'm near the end. Might as well. Oh yeah. Okay. All right. Next, I got Ultra Despair Girls. Oh, oh Don't Get Another episode. Hell yeah! We should play that sometime. Hey, maybe we should. Uh, anyway, what do you got? Uh, uh, well, speaking of that series, Danganronpa V3, which, uh, I don't like playing it because I don't want people to die. That's what people do, they die. <laughs> I know. It makes me sad every time. It's like, God damn it, I like that person. But anyway. Uh, well, I got Nier Automata here. I haven't played much of it, but, uh, just... I I I'm at the second part of the game, and... All right, all right, hold on. Let me interject for a second. Look at this. I blew up his halo... And he yeah, went back? He doesn't have this fucking... I've never had this problem before. Anyway, oh, Nier Automata. I'm playing the game over again because you gotta play it like two, three times, but it's the same game and it's making me unmotivated to play it a lot more, especially when I got these other four games here. Yeah. That's unfortunate, because it is fabulous. Yeah. What else you got? Uh, I got Metroid. It's kicking my ass. Like I'm, yeah. I'm just, I'm just bad at reflexes. I, I can't hit the things. I know they flash white, and you got to counterattack them. But it's just like, I shouldn't have to do that for the same cookie cutter enemy for, uh, like every floor. What area are you on? I uh, like area four or five. I can't even remember what the last power up I got was. I think I got the jump ball, <laughs> the ball oh, jump. You got a long way to go. Then. Once, I know. once you get, once you get the tri beam, the game becomes a lot more fun because you can just blow up everything and not have to do those special powers most of the time. Okay. The reflex is more for, like, the beginning of the game. It really relies on them. But when you get, enough, you get a good enough beam, you can plow through anything. All right, next game I got is Tales of Berseria. Fucking love it. It's great. Go play it. What do you got? Oh, well, recently... Well, not recently, I guess, but I've been trying to catch up with a bunch of Switch games I missed out on. So, I guess in combination Sonic Mania and Mario Kart. Still haven't finished those. Well, uh, the other one I've been playing is Night in the Woods for PS4. Night in the Woods? Is that a, is that a horror game? No, it isn't, actually. It's it's uh, sort of a... Not again! Are you <laughs> kidding? <laughs> oh, my God! Oh, God, this blows. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, it's a story-based game. It's uh, more about characters. It's more about telling a story than anything. It doesn't have a whole lot of gameplay to it. But it's got great style, great characters, uh, really a sobering message at the end. And mm -hmm. uh, they recently patched it to so where all the trophies work now. So. Oh, okay, good. 
Like, there was one jump that they couldn't get, so as a result, you couldn't get the last constellation, and you couldn't ah. get all the sketches, so no one could get the platinum as a result. And they patched it. I guess a guy went down and went through a whole bunch of things that nobody would even think to patch, and now it's, like, I got a, a super uber good now. All right, cool. Probably one of my favorite indie games, if it wasn't for the fact that also Dream Daddy and also Cuphead came out. And I just like those games for other reasons. It's just... It's a good time to be an indie developer right now, I'd say. Yeah, no kidding. Especially because every single major console is open to the idea of, hey, indie gamers and indie developers, we love you. Uh, oh, I guess I should say uh, one game I have been trying that I never actually finished is uh, Telltale's The Walking Dead. Since it is October, I figured I'd play a spooky game, or at least a horror game. Uh, mine's Hollow Knight. After uh, plowing through Metroid Samus Returns, Hollow Knight feels like a better experience. <laughs> you gotta juggle a lot of things, a lot of multitasking, you gotta focus. It's, it's, it's very Dark Souls, and I mean that in the best possible way. Yeah. Alright, alright. Come on, kill this is him. It now. Kill this the is bastard. It. This has gotta be there. it. There, there. Alright, so the green kill penis the came out. I'm gonna castrate this motherfucker. You just, you watch. Come on. Come on, you hit that damn thing. We're going a bit of a spiral. That seems to work pretty yeah, good. I, I don't the think way. I can stand one more wave that. of this. Kill it. Kill it. That's it. That's it. Check. That's yes! it. All right. All right. We bullshitted just long enough. God Here damn. The fight to be over. Yay. Oh, now the final cutscene of the game. Say goodbye to Dark Matter. Look at all those eyes. Yeah, say goodbye to Dark Matter. This is the ending of the Dark Matter trilogy. Dark Matter had a trilogy? Dark, yeah, it was Kirby's Dream Land 2, Kirby's mm -hmm. Dream Land 3, and now this. Because they were all directed by Shima Mora, and they all revolved around Dark Matter. Oh. So everyone gets metal, and everyone's, oh, everyone's so great, and hey, <laughs> everybody great gets show. crystal shards. <gasps> oh, Kirby, look and at an you. Adorable little kiss with the adorable little fairy, and then he breaks his neck. <laughs> The end! Kirby would later go on to write the best-selling novel, How I Broke My Neck, by Kirby Kirbson. My left foot. <laughs> I got I... kissed by a fairy, and then I died. So yeah, that was Kirby 64. What'd you think? Uh, it was pretty good. I, I mean, the constant complaint is it's going really slow, but... N64, there's not really much you can do about that, except, you know, grin and bear it, and go back in time ten years. Yeah. But yeah, it was pretty good. I mean, I recommend that people go out and play for themselves because the experience you have is going to be better than mine because I was out going for 100%. I <laughs> I looked at the guide, I got the powers, I did it strictly by the books, linear as fuck, but you're supposed to have a bit more freedom in this, you know, all that. I always thought that queen was really cute. Anyway, um... A yeah. glasses help. Yeah. Oh, I will say I love the combination powers. That was awesome. I really wish that they would bring the combination powers back. Instead, what they do is they have... They, they go the superstar route, where different... Uh, you push the D-pad differently, it does different things. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So a hammer can also be a fire power. Stone can also be for hammer, you know. Yeah, I, I wouldn't mind that, too. Like, if Kirby Switch ends up being not only bringing your friends along, but also combining powers, I think it'll do majorly well. I think if they make another 3DS Kirby game, they should have it with combinations instead of just trying to sell another goddamn <laughs> mini game as a full game. Oh, is that what the most recent one was? Yeah, well, the, I think it's like Battle Deluxe, Battle Royale Deluxe, or whatever. It's like we already got the Kirby fighting game. So yeah, that's the end. Dump back to title. Thanks for playing. So, what do you get for 100%? You unlock stuff. Okay. So we go down to options. We got uh, sound check, oh, boss battles, look at that. and uh, all that stuff. And I noticed you can watch the cutscenes. That's nice. Uh huh. Wait, wait a minute. What was that? More proof that the friends were supposed to make an appearance. That's cool. I like that little detail. They cut them off. So yeah, we got all that stuff, and uh, here's the bad ending. Oh. This is if you don't get all the crystal shards. 
They clear it all as all yeah, dark matter everybody's goes happy. Goodbye, fucks dark matter. and explodes. Yeah, yeah, but it actually didn't explode. It just fucks off. <gasps> uh oh. So everyone's all thank you. It's like, all right, yeah, I goofed up. All right, bye now. See ya later and all that. Hmm. And then, wait a minute. Before you go, Kirby, a friendly handshake. Indeed, he's so moved by it. Oh, God. All right, thanks again. Bye. See ya. Later. I love you better. Bye. All right. Good farewell, suckers. <gasps> Anyway, what? that's a bad ending. All right. <laughs> oh, that's cool. I like that. <laughs> Just a little glint saying. <laughs> so, so these are all the enemy infos. The all the cards that we got at the picnics. We only managed to get a scant few of them, which means we'd have to replay <laughs> a lot of levels, a lot of times to get a lot mm -hmm. of cards. And it's just. Uh... But we can check out the ones we did get though. Like this guy is Bobo. 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 And this is BB or B B Burnus. B Burnus. <laughs> and this is Cha Cha. And, and this is Kaka or Bumber. Bumber. Scarfy. Um, gotta have Scarfy. Just isn't Kirby without Scarfy. Two faced bastard. Anyway, that's all we got. So now it's time to go through the entire game again, level by level, get all those cards and show it to the people, right? Oh, you're very funny. No, what we got here is mini games, is what we Ooh. got. And, uh,. I'm gonna need your help on those, cause <gasps> mini games aren't as fun without a human player beside oh! me. So, come on, man. Next time on Kirby's Dream Collection, Kirby 64, we're gonna do some multiplayer fun stuff with the Nisco. Let's do it! Woo! <laughs>